I don't particularly um, like Ashley all that much. I think she's a bit of a whining bitch. Um, she's not that bad. I'm sorry. I apologize if you're an Ashley fan. Uh, she's not that bad. Ugh. She does like to complain an awful lot. Um, we've leveled up to level two, so we've got a few more points to throw on people. I'm going to put... Um, decryption and his first aid up. Uh, I'm gonna do your assault rifles and your soldier and armor and um, your pistols as well. There we go. Uh, we should have, um, hang on just a second let me go and open these crates if I haven't already. Uh, you'll find upgrade crates and stuff around and you can customise weapons and upgrade your weapons. Bum, 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 bum. A likely story, Ashley. I don't trust you. Um, armour. So you've picked up a better armour, so I'm going to steal that one. And... Uh, Are they, the other ones are any better? Let's, there we go. That's all I can upgrade at the moment. Um, I tend to keep uh, tend to keep things to sell them rather than turning them into Omni Gel. Somewhat disturbing. Looks painful. There's more of them and they've turned into naked zombies. Ooh. Crazy. What do you think? I think it's disgusting. Um, I was going to say something else then and I can't remember. I kind of started talking about naked zombies again. Stop talking about zombies, Lucy. Oh shit. Gaff. Gaff. Geth are awesome. They really are. They're uh, one of my favourite uh, Mass Effect races. If you like to call them that. That's it. Bag of the They're so cool. I love the design of them. I may make fun of their um, lamp shape. Lampshade heads, but uh, very cool. Ooh, muggles. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. Let's get moving. Williams, where's the camp? It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Change of plans, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Okay, Linus. Um, just let me check the equipment again. Picked up a few things. I think I've leveled up again, too. Uh, I don't use shotguns. Um, I don't think that Caden uses shotguns, either. Um, no, it's me. There we go. Uh, striker. See, we've got upgrades for that. <laughs> oh, hang on. I'm gonna pick it up. I don't tend to, uh, use my pistol much at all. I tend to just use the my assault rifle. Um, not Caden. I don't want to give Caden special ammo. I want to give myself some special ammo. 
Basic rounds, projectiles, actual damage done to target, shield bonus, uh, minus the damage, so you can knock off some shields, but it does a little bit less damage, and radioactive rounds. Um, yeah, half decent on synthetics, but uh, neither of them really are anything that I'm looking for at the moment. Um, I'm going to keep putting these things up, I just got a shield boost. Um, I'm going to put a barrier on too, and I'm going to pop up my adept as well. The squad can stay as they are for now. I haven't actually used any biotics yet. <laughs> Still trying to... Um, I'll have to have a look at that. I'll have to look that up and see what the, the quick button is. To Looks like they hit the camp in. hard. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. Oh. oh they don't God. quite look They're like naked zombies anymore. What did the Geth do to them? They're the colonists. <gasps> Right, okay, let's uh there we go. This is uh get out of my way and the squad tends to I like the way the squad put me into the corner. That's helpful guys, it's really helpful. Um They are husks. Husks in uh, in this first game. They are bastards in this first game. They are absolute bastards. They were still quite a bit tough in the second game. And in the third game, they were pussies. Well, not so much pussies. I think they, uh, it's just that uh, melee got a lot better. I don't think you can actually melee in this game, can you? In this first one. Um, melee got really good, and it was easier to just melee them in the, f in the third game. Uh, but, um, I don't know. Husks can be troublesome in this, uh, this first game. You let them get too close. Some more goodies. More goodies. Omni gel. That's what I know. Um... Ah, easy decryption. There we go. Just override it. That's easy, it's just a button sequence. They get a little bit harder as you go on, but they're not usually too Humans. difficult. Thank the maker. Hurry. Hello. Close the door before they come back. Look at you. How did you end up in this shed? We hid here during the attack. They must have come here for the beacon. Luckily it wasn't here. It was moved to the spaceport earlier this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Sounds delightful. What else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment, the next we were hiding in the shed while the Geth swarmed over the camp. Agents of the Destroyers, bringers of darkness, heralds of our extinction. We could hear the battle outside, gunfire, screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there, too afraid to move, until you came along. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well-preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies, groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? We have unearthed the heart of evil. Awakened the beast. Unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. Oh, I think he's cute. Did you notice a Turian in the area? I saw him, the prophet, leader of the enemy. He was here, before the attack. That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the Normandy before the attack. 
He couldn't have been here. I I'm sorry. Manuel's still a bit unsettled. We haven't seen your Turian. We've been hiding in here since the attack. What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. Say goodnight, Manuel. You cannot silence the truth. My voice must be heard. Ugh. Oh my god! What did you do? That might have been a little extreme, Commander. You can't just go around whacking people in the head. Just a little bump on the head. Let him sleep it off. I suppose you're right. By the time he wakes up, the meds will have kicked in. Williams, take us to the spaceport. Good luck, Commander. I actually feel kind of cruel doing that. Because he's not that crazy. You'll see. You'll all see. But it's just so funny. You can't go around hitting people in the head. I'm a fucking shepherd. I can do whatever the hell I want, bitch. What you doing, Iris? Sarah. Who? Hello. Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh. Oh shit. That doesn't look good. Nihilus. What is Holy it? fuck, what's distance. that? It's a ship. Look at the size of it. Oh my god. I take back saying you look like a hand. I apologize. Evil. It's evil. Run away. Run well, I'm sorry. You were right. They do that weird electrical power, electrical uh, attack thing. Uh, this first one. The husks makes them slightly more dangerous. And is this X X E? Everybody, stay calm out there. We're coming out. We're not armed. Hello. Is it safe? Are they gone? We took care of them. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Ah, uh, I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. I knew it was trouble the second I saw it. So we made a break for the sheds. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only, it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. 
Almost made it impossible to think. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that! We survived! If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance! The garage, you say? Do you know See? anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you gotta learn when to shut up. If there's something you're not telling me... Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. What kind of packages? I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. I'm only gonna ask this once. Think long and hard before you lie to me again. Are you sure all you've got is one lousy pistol? Uh... No, no wait, I just remembered. <laughs> I, I just had it in my pocket. Might as well take that too. That's everything, really. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. Okay, forget about it. I've got more important things to worry about. Good luck. Mm. We've got a stinger and a combat sensor. How awesome. Mm. Ooh, that's a really good pistol. I'm gonna have that, thank you very much. Um mm, 47 accuracy. Mm, we're dropping five in accuracy. Getting six in damage. I think it's worth it. There you go, Caden. Just for you. You can fuck off, Ashley. Oh, I'm so mean. Combat sensor. I'll have that. I won't have it on my. Uh... That is not what I wanted to do. I didn't want it on there. I want it on my thing. I want to see if I've picked up any of the bullets. No. Uh. What is that? Sniper rifle. Don't tend to use sniper rifles really either. Um, slightly better amp. Duration. Oh, I'm not that fussed, Caden. You can have that. Um, bu bu bu. You can have that, and you can have your barrier. Caden likes his barrier. I find Caden using his barrier quite often. Mm, assault training. I don't have anything else. Oh. Okay. Smugglers. Just have a little bit of an explore. Find anything else tucked away anywhere? Oh, some fire there. Commander, it's Nihilus. I will check you in just a moment. I think there is. Another, I need to get just a teeny bit closer. I don't want to get burned. Take them. Bah, 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 bah. Oh dear, Something's Nihilus, moving. What Open behind those crates. Wait! Don't, get don't out shoot! Here. I'm one of you! I'm human! What are you doing sneaking around back there? I, I am sorry. I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Pal. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Ooh. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And 
Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. We were told a Prothean beacon was brought to the spaceport. What happened to it? It's over on the other platform. Probably where that guy Saren was headed. He hopped on the cargo train right after he killed your friend. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I... I... I was already behind the crates when the attack started. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? I... Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I... I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? You ditch work, then you cower back here and do nothing while the Geth butcher everyone else. I don't even have a gun. What was I supposed to do? Run out there and die? Yes. I couldn't save them. Nobody could. It, it was horrible. Tell me about Tell it. Tell me about the Geth attack. It was quick. One minute that ship was descending, the next, those Geth were swarming over the platform. Thousands of them. They must have been inside that mothership. They shot anything that moved. It was a massacre. Tell me about this mothership you saw. I I've never seen anything like it before. It... It was huge. Landed over near that platform. The whole place got dark as it came down. And... It was making this noise, this... This sound that bored right into your brain. That's what woke me up. The attack came a few minutes later. Is there anything else you can tell me about the beacon? They brought it here this morning. We loaded it up onto the train and shipped it to the other platform. Hard to believe that was only a few hours ago. Feels like a whole other life. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. Okay, okay. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. Mm. Well, now. Nihilus is dead. That other Torian. Oh. Who are you shooting at? Oh. Well, they didn't even let me finish uh, talking about what I was talking about. So rude, these Geth interrupted me. Yeah, so Nihilus got shot in the back by uh, someone who was supposed to be his friend. Waha, in your face, Gath. In your face. Kaden, your life is really low. Don't get yourself killed. You can use your sabotage on him. What have I got? I've got throw, barrier, shield boost. <laughs> I knew you were going down, Caden. Pain in the ass. Alright, I'll get back in a minute. Yeah, I'll 
little bit low. Get down. There we go. You can't look, no, Kaden. You missed the fight. She vanished too. Oh, she's behind me. Okay. I think I leveled up again then. Oh, there he goes. Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. What? You're gonna blow us up, you bastard. Yo. Yeah, we're coming. and then put Caden's health back up. Let it just, uh, save. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. We need to find them all and shut them down. I'm sorry, I don't mean to be mean. Mean to be mean. Mean to be mean. To be mean. I just That makes me a hypocrite. I know I have an annoying voice. I'm squeaky. But I'm squeaky in an adorable way. She's just annoying. Cover me, guys! There's no sort of decent um, map to speak of. This first one. Caden's down again. He's only got um, light armor. So he's getting his little self shot up very easily. And there's one more charge just around here. I mean, they give you plenty of time do these charges. Never um, run out of time doing them. Um, look around.
just double checking and being careful. I can't, um, being a little overcautious. I can't quite remember, like, where all the, uh, upgrade boxes and stuff are. Uh, guns and weapons and ammo things. So, just, uh, be a little bit thorough. Check everywhere. Seems like a big open space over there. Feels like they could have put some things there. Um, there we go, Caden. Heal you up. Might as well. Good, good, good. I'm gonna have to um, have a little look in the book and see, because I'm sure that there was there's a button um, for a quick fire button for your abilities. You can map your ability to uh, a quick fire button. Maybe, maybe that's not until. Second one. I can't remember. It's on cooldown at the moment. Let me just uh have a little look at these things. B X Y Boxy. Um I think there is yeah, there's an extra little storage over over there. More safe. Uh, y X A X. Um, it all comes in handy making sure you try and get any, all the things out of all the crates because even if you don't use them or your squad don't need them, then uh, you can sell them or you can make harmony gel out of them, and it all comes in handy. Um, good to have pennies and it is good to have plenty of omni gel as well just in case you fuck up on the decryptions okay let's uh examine this protean beacon then normandy the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. Something must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. What is it? Ooh. Oh. Oh, that can't be good. Can't even shepherd. Save him. Oh shit. Oh no, I'm in trouble. Shepard! Oh god. No, don't touch her. It's too dangerous. Ugh. God. That's gotta be some kind of subliminal message of a mass murder. It's creepy. Oh, beacon went boom. We identified the ship that touched down on Eden Prime, the Normandy, a human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson, 
they managed to save the colony. And the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. Arr, arr. Saren's a dinosaur. This human must be eliminated. Patriarch boobies. <laughs> 